Tottenham Hotspur are making plans to recruit in the winter transfer window. Fresh from their 3-0 win over Burnley, they are targeting Everton midfielder Ross Barkley and Manchester United left-back Luke Shaw. Neither of them are settled at their current club, with Barkley yet to commit to Everton's new manager Sam Allardyce, and Shaw left out of United's starting lineup yesterday, despite a defensive injury crisis. Paper Rounds view, Barkley has technique and potential, but needs guidance from a manager to apply himself more effectively on the pitch. Shaw can play, but has failed to impress three consecutive managers with his fitness and attitude. Mauricio Pochettino was the last manager who was impressed by him, so it makes sense for these two relatively young English players to move to a club where they can expect chances and the opportunity to improve themselves. Read the full story United may not renew Mourinho's contract Manchester United's board are reluctant to give Jose Mourinho a new contract and a pay rise, after Manchester City raced away at the top of the table. After spending £300 million they expected a sustained title challenge, but Mourinho has failed to impress with his pragmatic approach to some games, and the lead that City have managed to amass. As a result, he may not be given a new contract. Manchester United's English defender Chris Smalling attends a press conference on the eve of the UEFA Champions League Group A football match between FC Basel and Manchester United on November 21, 2017 in Basel. Getty Images Paper Rounds View If Manchester United's board are looking for someone to blame, they could try looking at Ed Woodward. It is Woodward who left Mourinho having to pick from Matteo Darmian, Phil Jones, and Herrera, Chris Smalling, Marwan Fellaini and other substandard purchases. The Glazers are known for their reluctance to spend to win trophies when they are happy with Champions League football alone, but they should look at Woodward's future, not Mourinho's. Read the full story City plot Fred Bid Pep Guardiola is already planning for the summer transfer window. Guardiola has identified Fred, Shakhtar Donetsk's forward, as a way to improve the midfield, along with Borussia Dortmund youngster Julian Weigel. There is room for reinforcements in midfield a Yaya Toure is expected to depart. City are also keeping an eye on Southampton's central defender, Virgil van Dijk. Fred, Schachter, Fernandino, Manchester City, Twitter paper rounds view, Guardiola has alighted on a situation that most other managers would envy. Despite being on course to achieve a brilliant league win, the club are happy to back him with yet more money. Instead of cruising with what they have already, he is being given the cash to strengthen yet further. His record for purchasing players at Bayern and City has improved since his time at Barcelona, which all goes well for City. Read the full story Mkhitaryan wanted by Inter Milan Newly minted Italian club Inter Milan want Henrik Mkhitaryan on loan for the second half of the season. They could not yet afford the £35 million asked for by United without breaking financial fair play regulations. United are wasting no time in working out how to replace the Armenian, having identified Bordeaux's Malcolm as a potential January replacement, as well as Mazet Erzul and William, both former players of Mourinho. Manchester United's Armenian midfielder Henrik Mkhitaryan, L, celebrates after scoring a goal, with teammate Swedish forward Zlatan Ibrahimovic Getty Images Paper Rounds View, Mkhitaryan has done nothing to suggest that Mourinho's diagnosis of him as a lightweight is incorrect. While he might succeed elsewhere, it appears beyond him at Manchester United, whereas with Ozil and William, both know the requirements to impress Mourinho. Malcolm may also be a temporary solution, but it would be asking too much of a young player in France to settle into England quickly. Read the full story.